I'm gonna eat pizza again in the vlog today. Judge me. You can hate me now. I won't stop. But I won't stop now. I can't stop. Cause I can't stop. Finally getting it in. So far, so good. This is gonna be really shaky footage, so I'm not gonna film it for that long. Going to do a circuit, uh, and then pizza circuit after this. We'll catch up with you in a moment. Did you see how fast that dog was? The guy said it used to work a lot better when he was a puppy because he wouldn't be able to keep up with it, but now he catches it every time, so it doesn't quite have the same effect. Uh, I'm out here running around the park to hit a few of these pieces of equipment on the circuit. I'm not going to be able to hit them all before the sun sets, but I mostly just want to get enough in so that I can have some pizza after I'm done, as with most of my workouts. So the running is not my favorite part. The circuits, however, I really like a lot. Uh, the workout part of it, but the running part, uh, I gotta work on my cardiovascular strength. It's a perfect day for it though. A lot of people out and about. Some that golf course I played at is over there. Sunset right there. And bars right here. If you've ever wondered what running is like, let me just give you a first person point of view. Just this. Sometimes you can look up, but mostly you're just looking forward so you don't trip over anything. Oh, what's going on in the neighborhood? Oh, jeez, I almost tripped. I can run a quarter of a half marathon someday. I'll be happy. workout essentials except for that last one you don't need that 
or at least I don't need that. Um, it was a great workout. The circuit part, if you have something like that in your in your neck of the woods, be sure to hit it up. Or even if you don't, it's uh, pretty basic moves with any kind of bar. Um, but stay tuned for the best part, the pizza party coming a little bit later. I'm not even going to edit that last part out because apparently my mom's right. I've got to have a cat in every video, whether I mean to or not. Uh, so I watched a video earlier today with Casey Neistat, big YouTuber, previous vlogger, sold a company he created called Beam to CNN for a large amount of money. And a lot of people thought that that was him selling out because they're a big corporation. He went from YouTube to a big opportunity like that, selling his company uh, to a big corporation. Um, but I've got to agree with him on a lot of the points in the video where he was talking about, really, he's just making his dreams of filmmaking align with reality, um, to be providing for his family um, and living real life, but also following his dreams and passions, which is being creative. And now he gets paid very well to do that. So I have to say, think of any anybody, really, that's successful, that you admire and think we don't think that Led Zeppelin sold out, did they? When they uh, signed a record contract to be able to produce their music for a larger audience. Uh, can you imagine if the Beatles or Led Zeppelin or any great music act said, nah, we're just going to stick to the garage. We'd rather not uh, play our music for a big audience. Because Casey's right, looking back, they probably don't even think about now that they're selling out these big arenas, they're looking back to before when they put in all the hard work that we didn't see. Um, so check out his video about selling out. And I will add, though, if Casey or anybody's doing it for the wrong reasons, if they um, do not agree with CNN or do not agree with uh, any of the conditions that they're, they're selling their product to, then that definitely is selling out if they aren't aligning their values with the company who they're being purchased by as values. I'd say that's definitely selling out, but not pursuing your dreams and passions and making a living from it. So check out the video. I'll link to it below. And um, don't forget to put in your hard work to be able to sell out someday and make your dreams a reality. On to the good stuff now. Pizza party. All right, one more example for you. It's going to be like when I finally get sponsored by Lenny and Larry's Cookies. That's not going to be me selling out. That's going to be me selling in to something incredibly delicious and nutritious. It's something that I believe in, and then I'll be getting free cookies for life from them. So why wouldn't I sell in to the complete cookie by Lenny and Larry's? Fairy tales can come true. Right, Lenny and Larry's? Fairy tales can come true. On to the good stuff now. It's pizza time. Let's do this. Do you guys want anything? Pepperoni? Cheese? No, you want Supreme. Also, shameless plug, if you haven't seen my Lenny and Larry's rap yet, link below. Check it out. I rapped about Lenny and Larry's cookies. Check it. So, gone. I ate the whole thing already. Sweetheart loves a 